มอนโอเค hello everyone s a m i n here from myfirstmagicweb.com um, just um, trying to make a video about my um, the ear that I'm trying to make uh, working on it it's not only one it's now I'm working on several um, you know same same story but different angle different um, entry uh, scenarios I'm putting it in all five minute chart and I've been working on this for months and months now I had the strategy and uh, you all know that you know so my first magic wave magic wave is the strategy and it's not uh, unknown anymore <laughs> but uh, putting it to a uh, automated system is wasn't easy I mean uh, I'm, I'm really for years and years uh, just sitting in front of the charts and uh, trying to trade uh, you know trying to find the setup and just switching the charts from here even though if you have four six monitors eight monitors and you, know, you got too many pairs and you know you have to do analyzation and all this you know, like what's happening on a four hour and a one hour and what pair and this pair and that pair and then make a decision it's a hell of a work <clears throat> been doing it for years but now I'm tired so that's the reason I was uh, after this idea that if I could put it together uh, and then, you know, one thing leads to another and then, you know, I saw it, possibility and then, you know, very solid possibility and then I started making, putting together. But I gave uh, this strategy to make this year to a uh, couple of uh, people, um, but uh, unfortunately they took off with my strategy, uh, my, you know, my course would have over made and <laughs> I never got to see anything back. So what I decided is that, you know, I might as well learn the damn thing, uh, how to make codes and everything. And it's not easy. It's just like, uh, you know, first of all, you know, making the EA, uh, putting the course together uh, is like, uh, uh, you know, learning poetry, you know, how, how to, you know, like a poet. Uh, and not only that, uh, you have to do your uh, poetry in, in Chinese. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Especially as English speaking or, you know, some other language speaking uh, person or trying to learn this uh, coding language, MQ, MQ4, it's, 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 you know, it's strange. <laughs> not easy, not easy. But anyway, uh, so I, um, I've been working on this and today uh, I opened this uh, FXDD uh, demo account. Let me show you this. Thing. This is see this FXDD um, account. And I, I, I prepare a new version actually today, finalized. So I said, well, let me open a new account and see, you know, from scratch what it does. And uh, by, when, by the time I opened it, um, the, this, you see this move, the whole move, we had a nice move today. So the whole move started already. But uh, I think, let me see if I can pinpoint, like, see, I opened this $10,000 um, demo account. Uh, see the date, to, uh, December 27th. It's 1.54, uh, it's like 2 o'clock, which is a five-hour difference, so it's like 2, 3 or 4. No, but the first order, uh, see this order got kicked in at 9, which is 10, 11, 12, 2. So 2 o'clock in the morning, Eastern Time, 2 o'clock in Miami or New York Time. Right now it's um, 4.40, so it's only like, it's not even three hours so far. So I put, uh, put it on here this and then uh, you can see uh, first uh, this something New Z Yen gave me a couple of um, negative but then uh, this account I opened at 10,000 and see right now the thing that I want to show is that um, this um, this EA that I have uh, is uh, it's a Sam's EA V3 because I had one and then V1 and V2 and you know, now it's V3 and then V3 part one <laughs> Believe me, too many work, too much work, too many things to do. Anyway, so um, <clears throat> um, <clears throat> this one, and after that, I place uh, on on that everything uh, on these. Um, and by the way, this is what I'm going to show you right now. This is only yen pairs because the USD pairs are all crooked, and this was not working on that. So uh, I have it on, but nothing kicked in on the USD pairs. Only one. So I gotta do the adjustment there. Uh, I still need to do a lot of work, but, um, uh, you know, it's amazing so far. 
so ten thousand dollar account and uh, another thing that this uh, thing is uh, auto adjusting auto lot size actually what it's an auto adjust it adjusts the lot size itself so based on the equity and the risk amount you you, you give it to. so I think I have a little higher than usual or should be that's why you see this 0 0.69 0 0.64 these are uh, mini lots 0 0.77 this is 0 0.2 okay all of these lots open and now this is pending buy stop buy stop buy stop the market is going up so everything is buy stop uh, 0 0.65 0 0.65 so far from two o'clock till now within two and a half hour my floating profit you can see here is 1450 this is 1450 you see all these open orders here all of these this is auto largest it's all based on seven lot seven mini six mini two mini seven mini because the uh, the amount uh, of the uh, the demo account is ten thousand I should have made uh, three thousand and see what it does it, it will I'll show you what what happened in two thousand or three thousand dollar account because I have two versions running one on this one and the other one on the IBFX so you can see how is this <clears throat> it's beautiful um, all of these are entry, but on this one, by the time I, I hooked this up on the E on this account, the move, you know, the first entry, I got it here. You see this high here? This is the entry, and, and this EA plays a buy side. It doesn't buy in the market uh, uh, price uh, order. Uh, it, it places a buy orders, a buy stop or sell stop orders. Okay, uh, on the setup, it will put a buy stop on the high of it plus some other, you know, little uh, cushion. I have like three or five pip, I don't know, uh, a cushion amount here. So this is, uh, you can see here, this is an order placed here. If you go more high, then I have two orders already, and this one is going to take a third one. And just keep this, uh, SL will be, see the first two SL are here, and then the last one is here, the black line. See, I have different stages. See that this SL is moving with the black line. And, uh, you know, first it starts with the yellow, then the black, then the red, then the blue. It will just follow. Uh, on certain uh, pippage, uh, we, I'll be uh, blocking the profit. So, so far I have code made to follow as from this black line. But then I'll have it like uh, uh, once I'm 50 or 60 pip in profit, then the SL will start following this red line tip. And then... You know, maybe a hundred or close to 170, 80 pip. This SL will still, you know, go up and and just follow the blue line tip and book most of the profit. But so far, it's amazing that you know if it kicks in. Uh, imagine this one order, two order, three order. This is the fourth one. This is also getting a fifth one. And then <laughs> all right, so this is um, it's not easy, believe me or not. It wasn't easy, but finally I I, I got it. Uh, I still need to do some uh, some more things here. Like I said, it's, you know, SL fixing and some other uh, you know more orders, uh, one minute entry as well. I, I'm, I'm thinking uh, to uh, employ that in uh, as well. Right now it's only five minutes, so I can add one minute entries and in, in fifteen minute and maybe not you know, one minute and five minutes are enough, I guess. So look at this, you know, this um, only part uh, in U.S. pairs. USD per pound, USD was in uh, agreement, the higher time frame was in agreement with the with the five minutes, so that's why it just took it, otherwise uh, none of these uh, other like Euro USD and Aussie and nothing. Uh, all I have is like Euro Yen, you can see here, it took one order here, and that's it, just gone. There's, uh took one, and I don't know what happened to these orders, still have to buy stuff. Maybe kicked in and got deleted or something. I don't know. But, you know, it's a lot of things happening. I, I can't even, you know, I'm too tired. Here, you see this pound yen uh, buy order here. It took one entry here, placed two entries here, and then both took it. So I got three entries here. And uh, SL is right around here somewhere. Uh, yeah, see SL here. So I'm going to move it to black line and the red line. Got Still got to make the code for that. To book most of the profit once you you know it's like three orders if you have 50 pip move and you have one order here one here and one here and then you know it's like 30 and then 20 and so you got more paper pipage than the move itself that's the beauty of this system okay so i'm gonna make that and um let's see uh, aussie n has nothing 
I don't know why um, this is attached here. Maybe they are some higher time frame. Not uh, yeah, Aussie. Ah, yeah, Aussie is in downtrend. The higher time frames are still in the downtrend, or maybe turning. So, not in agreement. And this one you can see here. This is going crazy, man. Frankie, uh, Frank Yen. So one order was you see the buy order here. If I had uh, put it a little early, I would have probably taken here. here you know. So one order here, one order here. Maybe it will, you know, bump into it again in the in the wave. Then I may get another order, and then it's keep going up. <laughs> I told everybody that this this pair is in on on you know some drug or something. And it's like it's keep going really really strong. Frank Yen, I'm talking about. And you can see here the Cad Yen is not moving. So it plays an order and then get uh, deleted. Another one get deleted. Another one get deleted and still there. So the beauty of this placing the buy stop order instead of getting the momentum bar and then just open the trade is that uh, when the momentum bar is right here and then it goes up and then at the high of the last high, it can't break it and then it drops. So it's like a decision and then, you know, should I take it? Should I not? Should I take it? Should I not? It's, it's a lot of things. Uh, but it still was a profitable system. It is still, but, you know, making it automated is much, much better. Uh, New Zealand, see how many orders it placed it. This is the one. This is the one uh, it gave me only two negatives so far. See this two negative? Uh, minus 67 and this minus $78 because it was seven and a half pip, uh, seven and a half uh, uh, lot, uh, mini lots, 0 0.75, 0 0.75. So that's why. And this one got deleted by stop. Uh, there was a one standard lot, but it, it got just got deleted. Okay. This is how it was. So all the yen pairs are looking beautiful. Um, uh, instead of, uh, except this one, <laughs> it went down. Everything was going up because of the USD. USD started, you know, weakening today. So, well, I don't care what happens out there as long as uh, my thing is. Okay, let me show. The other account is IBFX, also a demo account that I opened a few days ago. And, and today, I started with this uh, amount. It's, uh, 2000, it was 2020 some dollar. When I started today, I, I uh, put this thing here. Uh, for, uh, put some, uh, uh, I, I made some changes and put this thing on. This one has different system, this different entry scenario. And it is taking uh, these... Um, USD pairs as well. Let me show you. A lot of people are talking about that. Don't show it. Don't make it so as well. You know, if somebody can understand it and make his own ear, you know, might as well do it. I don't care. Uh, let's check out the Euro USD on this one. You see, oh boy, how many orders this one opened? Up? See here, so buy, buy, then again buy here. So three orders so far. Okay, I think I have a setting that is not more than three. Up to three, it will take. So, and imagine this was, a, you know, entry probably here. Not, no, it's no entry here. This was the first entry here, yeah. Okay, so this one, Euro USD, and this has, like I said, different scenario than the other one. This is called Sam's Treasure. <laughs> this is V2, volume two, okay. And look at the pound here, going very nice, doing very nice. We have one, two entries already. SL is gone up here for both. I got three entries already. One, two, three SL I see here. So I got three SL, a uh, three and oh yeah, one, two. No, the third SL, actually third SL is for the buy stop order in place right now. It's not kicked in yet. If we go up, then it will kick in. See this says buy stop. This is a pending order. So we have two entries, two SL move to this blue line, the tip of the blue line. And uh I'm going to make the chords that um, if it goes, uh, the profit goes maybe like 50 pip, 60 pip, then the SL move to this black line. And then even if more than 75 pip profit or, or, or you know, um, gain, then the, the SL will be on the red line, the tip of the red line. Okay, so look at this uh, Aussie. Yeah, see this one. Like I said, on the other, <coughs> it wasn't taking any USD uh, pair entries because the scenario was different and then the higher time frame was not 
an agreement and this one higher time frame has nothing to do with it it's just a five minute uh, system and then uh, this one uh, took it got deleted and then took a short got deleted to, when the price went up there it never uh, hit the buy stop but then it took this one and I think it's one two SLIC so uh, it has only two orders already the SL is about to hit now here uh, and the third one is if your SL is not hit and then if you go up then the third one gonna get kicked in third one is 0.11 because it's just a uh, $2,000 uh, account on this one uh, you can see some Frankie nice entries see it's sold here this was a buy stop I and mean then sell a stop and then it took out here made an entry here the other one was here took that and the third one was here took that and it's all the way down my SL should be at least at the black line right now what's the how much pipage I'm talking about is 8893 at this tip of the black line is 85 right 85 86 so it's four five yeah talking about seven more pips book as a profit or maybe I'll go just to this one the red line uh, which will be yeah you know 15 16 pip but if it keeps going then you know it will just follow the black line the tip of the black line it's called a uh, uh, moving average uh, trailing uh, ma trailing ma okay the, 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 you know the trailing stop is not fixed amount is the ma the sl will be trailing with the ma okay it depends which ma i want uh, to trail so that's why I have three right now there. So I can, you know, just move this SL, this MA, and then more profit. Then it goes to the other MA, and then the other. I still need to make the code for that. Um, USD Yen. See, not even on this one. This pair didn't open any. It opened one, probably got negative. I don't know. Oh, by the way, this is a 2010 account. And right now it is running 500, 504. You know, it's, it's, it's amazing. And uh, how many open orders? You see, all of these are open orders. It's 0 0.09, 0 0.09, 0 0.08, 0 0.08, 0 0.04. This is 0 0.1. This is like all like micro large because the amount of the balance is small. It's only two thousand dollars. So it is play, uh, placing uh, micro large. Okay, I still have free margin, very little. 67 even if this year if it, it opens more orders and everything has to close uh, I, I will close with this 500 profit not bad in one day with a two thousand dollar account now you see all of these pending orders these are placed in different pairs this is all the yen all the yen all the USD all the USD all the USD pound USD buy stop buy stop buy stop all of these are buy stop you see pound Aussie Probably I put it in, I don't know. Okay, so all of these are buy stop. Euro yen, you can see here, see? Nice entries. Starting from here, the first one was here. This is the beauty of it, then if I am following the amaze, the SL, uh, it just keep going and following. See, it's, a tip, <coughs> it's on the tip of this uh, blue line. So it is follow, uh, following that. Pound yen also opened this buy here. SL moves to this blue line tip. And uh, right now it's about to, it already did, I guess. Yeah, it just took another one, buy order. All right, so I don't know if it's going to come and, and knock me out or whatever. You know. It's just uh, happening on, it, on its own. I'm not even uh, doing my uh, analyzing or anything. or <laughs> Technical analysis, just making this and let it run. That's it. Aussie yen, see that? Um, I think it's only one order here. Took, no, not even one. It's about to take one now. Buy stop order in place. And if it goes up, it will take out. If it goes below this yellow line, this order will be canceled. And then we look for another opportunity. This is how it is. Frank yen took two orders already. Buy here, buy here. SL for both. Following this blue line. CAD, everything. See if you know, well, no, CAD yen, nothing, nada. 
New Zealand, we have order in place, no live order right now, but it, you know, the setup was here, you can see, this magic web setup, old, you know, same old thing we were using. But it's a lot of a lot of people out there were trying to make an automated system. Uh, this is strategy, and and uh, I don't know. It's a lot. Maybe some of them are already did succeed. I, I don't know. But uh, I I try to get a help from few people. But um, they I explain everything, and then uh, more than halfway success, and they just disappear. You know? So I know my strategy is selling everywhere on the websites and eBay and all that here there. Uh, maybe, I don't know, right now, uh, you know, this thing also <laughs> for sale. And I'm still making it. <laughs> maybe somebody has already made it and, and selling it. I have no idea. But <laughs> anyway, you know, it, it just regardless what other people are doing, it's important that what I am doing here. And uh, hopefully... Um, the rest of this uh, this year, whatever we have, a uh, few more days, I'll uh, fine tune it. Put another <coughs> too sleepy. Uh, put another uh, entry system, maybe one minute, um, and uh, I need to do a few more, you know, stop loss adjustments. And hopefully next year uh, we're gonna have a blast. Okay, so um, yeah, my son um, asking me to get a boat. So we can go fishing <laughs> on our own. So I'm looking forward to it. And this is how it is. Uh, so I just wanted to uh, update that what this is what I'm doing, especially my subscribers. All of those, you, you might be getting maybe, you know, uh, anxious that, you know, what the hell I'm doing, or where am I, not doing uh, you know, webinars, getting late. This is what I'm doing. And this is going to be for everybody, all of you, believe me. <laughs> okay. Um, so this is it. This one of the show it. And uh, I'm going to put it on the YouTube as well. And, um, you know, people um, can get ready uh, to get it, you know, get connected. I'm going to open an account. And, you know, once they are up and running nice and clean, um, let's see how much is it in total. What's going on? This one, the two thousand dollar account is a four sixty four right now, and the other one is running what? See, it was up to twelve thirteen. Now it's nine eight. This is what I'm talking about. That is squeezing the stop losses. Then also, I'm uh, making a script which will uh, once drop on one of these chart, will close all the trades uh, in one shot. Uh, on that on that particular broker so once you are over a thousand a day or something you know decent whatever you think decent is you know 300 400 500 whatever uh, close everything go to sleep or you know have fun but right now you know this is uh, in uh, I uh, put that here yeah okay so two o'clock so I attach it at two o'clock right now it's five three hours and uh, this is what happened so I can I can put the timer 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 here too. So what time you know maybe like Frankie and London Open this EA uh, gets active, and then uh, move starts. All the pair start taking entries. One two three maybe I'll increase that to five. Don't know. Uh, I I might have to because if I want the one minute entries uh, on one minute I probably have to put maybe ten or something. But one minute uh, makes a lot of uh, you know entries. Uh, into the wave, uh, and then uh, all of those would be a potential uh, new order, new entry. So <clears throat> this is how it is in front of you. Um, and uh, very, very soon, with the help of God, I should be able to uh, place it in, in, in an account where everybody can get connected and print uh, some dollar like that in real world okay forget about the demo this is a demo account but you know this is exactly what it is this is forward testing that's what we call it. forward testing now the thing is that a lot of people say yeah this is you know, see that the, the beauty of this is that see this one is it's a buy stop order okay if the market is slow is ranging what it does is will do like that 
And if you take an order here already, like a market uh, order, it can drop and get your SL out, right? But in this one, if it is stopped, uh, like uh, the move is stopped already, and then now maybe it's going to start ranging. So what it does is this makes like it's a high, then it comes, make an entry, you put a uh, buy stop here, then it drop here, and cancel, delete this buy stop order. Then it makes a lower low, then goes into the wave, and place a sell stop below that low. But if it goes up, that will be deleted. So that's this is how it's ranging, and I can save myself from getting uh, uh, you know negative because uh, those orders will be deleted. They will not be uh, kicked in. If there is a momentum in the market, like if the move is starting now here, this yellow line, you see how it's, you know this white. All of these MAs, you know all of these, right? So they are all uh, lined up and everything, and then if the move has to go up, uh, this order will be taken out, and then SL will be kicked in, following that one of these MAs, and you know, so on and so forth. So it's much safer, and especially automated. So we have to just you know, uh, hook it up and then go do whatever, uh, enjoy your life. All right, so um, I'm going to just load it up and then go to sleep. I'm too sleepy. Okay. <clears throat> what is this thing? It's, oh, this is history. All right, this is history. That's what I'm saying. So how come it's 900? Now, it's not 900. It's 1427. That's the, the current equity right now. This is floating profit. It's 1427 on this account alone. This, uh, IV, uh, this is FXDD from 2 o'clock this morning. All of these kicked in. All of these orders, see, and and not too many. Um, I mean, it's not even a too big of a move. Let's see how much the first order was kicked in here, one seventy to forty, and the price right now is where uh, the price from forty. It's only eighty two. One seventy two, eighty two. Okay, this is one seventy two forty one. You can see it's, what, it's a 40 pip in pound yen, by the way, which is a big mover, right? Uh, let's say euro yen. How many pips so far? Right. 44.01. We are at 44.60. So 60 pip move in here, 40 pip move there. That's all. It's a small move, not, not a big like 100, 150, 200 pip move. Imagine when that kind of move, what this thing is going to do. How many orders? Okay. This will um, probably just miss another order here. <laughs> but anyway. All right. So this is it. Okay. This is uh, gone to 1,500 now. This is <laughs> oh, man. All right. How many pending orders so far? Look at this. I got two here, pending order on a New Zealand, three orders here, and then Euro, Euro USD on FXDD? No. Yeah. Are you sure? Let me go see what's happening on there. Hmm. Finally. I think, oh, yeah. Okay. Finally, the Euro USD is going to get kicked in. Maybe or maybe not. I don't know. It, it, it plays a buy stop. It means all this... Um, time didn't place any order because the higher time frame were not in in agreement uh, this uh, you know, Sam's EA is uh, you know it, you need to have like you know certain condition on a daily four hour one hour 15 and five the other one Sam's treasure it's simply one you know five minute I may put some filter in it but so far it is as it is it's working fine on IBFX here, on a two, so this is just a five-minute uh, entry. Five-minute scenario it has nothing to do with 15, one hour, four hour, anything. So that's why um, this one, and then like I said, uh, pound was uh, um, pound has okay, it has not taken this one out yet, and uh, Aussie has no uh, entry because uh, the higher time frame are off. New Z or Kiwi also. No entry. Frankie also no entry, even though the other account took one to three entry in this one. So, you know, we can put it together, both ears on both sides, and then take 
entries you know, on both sides. Anyway, I'm off now. I'm going for uh, sleep. Um, so this is it. Uh, just be ready. Especially my subscribers, uh, they will get advantage uh, being subscriber, definitely. <laughs> Uh, and um, hmm, okay. Turn this up. All right. Okay, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Um, I'm going to sleep. I don't know. Uh, just go to sleep or do whatever you're doing. <sighs> All right. Bye now. See you guys later soon.